Hey guys, Morgan Pobert here, and today we're going to talk about the biggest mental roadblocks for entrepreneurs. Let's get to it. Hi guys, so welcome to another video. My name is Morgan Pobert, and this channel is all about how to buy and grow businesses. And I'm here to basically document and share my journey in the process. I've been doing it full time for the last three years. And I want you to learn from my mistakes, learn from some of my lessons, lessons that cost me literally a small fortune. To, to learn uh, money that I paid either to mentors or money that I paid for my mistakes and I'm gonna share everything I can with you guys now most people out there talking about starting businesses if they want to become entrepreneurs I'm here to show you in this channel that you can go and buy existing profitable business with many times the same amount of money that it will it will cost you to start one and I'm here to also show you that if you have an existing business your best way to grow isn't by doing more in sales and marketing maybe in the first year or two you can really grow fast with just doing sales and marketing but in the end of the day you can grow much faster if you're going to use um, basically a, a, a different way to grow the business which is to go and buy your competitors or go and buy complementary businesses and that's what the biggest companies out there are doing um, I, I keep mentioning the fact that Facebook buying companies like Snapchat like uh, sorry like uh, Instagram or WhatsApp and Amazon buying companies like Whole Foods so that's what I think you should do as well now if you didn't yet subscribe to the channel like this video and comment below help me with the engagement help me grow the channel and see in the description below there's a link to our free business buying mastermind it's a free Facebook group so join it if you didn't yet because there's amazing people out there who are doing deals all the time so join it and there's unique content there as well and see also in the description below last thing is that I'm looking to upload daily videos so see in the description below uh, a, a link to a form where you can put your personal information and give me ideas for basically new videos that I can create so go and do that right now as well and I just noticed that I have my here pause again so yeah that's it let's get to the video so today we're going to talk about some of the biggest mental roadblocks for people and I'm getting lots of those questions people asking me questions and they think that an answer about the strategy will change their results and that's what I thought when I begin in, in business in general I thought that I just need a better strategy I just need the next tip the next trick or the next skill in order to really uh, break through and become successful but over time what I learned the biggest thing that I learned is that really to, to be successful and I think Tony Robbins is saying that is that 80% of it is psychology and your mindset and the strategy is only like 20% of the results yes you can learn the next skill and especially nowadays there's so much content out there you actually have the content to be successful right now if you really want to buy a business you do have the content what you're missing is the mindset and the person behind you to give you the accountability and I guess to tell you if what you're doing is wrong or right and you need the certainty to take action you don't need more content most of the time maybe if you're new to this space and don't know anything yes you need a bit of bit of, a little bit of content but to really break, break through and become successful it's all about the mindset that you have and I want to really dive into it because lots of the questions that I'm getting people think that they just need an answer for that question but what I found out is that even if I give them the answer directly it's literally like a band-aid to a much bigger problem so today we're going to talk about all the different roadblocks or mental roadblocks that I see lots of the time and what it comes down to in the end of the day in my opinion and based on every one that I learned from and I still learn from in this space of mindset and I work with coaches on a weekly basis to, to work on my mindset but what I found out and what I learned is that it all comes down in the end of the day to fear and that fear leads to self-sabotage so lots of the actions that you're taking are going to self-sabotage yourself if you don't have the right mindset and believe that what you're doing is the right thing so I want to really dive into some of the biggest things that you can notice within yourself or work on to make sure that you're taking the right action and eventually becoming successful so the first thing I want to talk about is self-doubt and the idea of self-doubt is that people always think oh am I doing this right am I doing this wrong and they're just literally self-doubting themselves all the time and they're literally can't take action they can't take action they think that they need to learn the next strategy they take the next course to watch the next video or listen to the next podcast or read the next book and it's all because they have self-doubt in their heads and they're not sure about the next action especially again nowadays with all the info out there 
Now it's funny because the first time I heard about it, I thought I don't have that problem. I don't have self doubt. I read all the books. I watched all the seminars already. I know how to deal with it. I'm aware of it within myself. But as time goes, uh, I really understand that it's still a, a very, very difficult process and it's sneaky. It will come to you. I don't care how successful you are. That self doubt will come to you all the time. I don't care how successful you are. There's always the next level and that self doubt will come to you again and again and again. And it all comes down in the end of the day to you asking yourself the wrong questions. You're thinking with yourself, hey, will that work for me? Why would that work for me? I'm too old, I'm too young, I don't have the experience, I do have too much experience. All that self-doubt coming from all of those internal questions within yourself. Every day you're saying, hey, what if they're wrong? What if they're wrong? What if this is right? What if what I'm... Like literally you have so many thoughts within your head. You have thousands of different thoughts every day and every thought is competing with another and what you come you, you literally can't make the decision you have so many different thoughts every thought's taking you to a different place and you just can't make a certain action and what the first thing i i really urge you to do and, and suggest you to do is start to change your thoughts within yourself literally start to ask positive thoughts instead of asking why wouldn't that work ask yourself hey what if that would work what if i can trust myself and that would work or really put yourself in the position of you being already successful and you already being where you want to be and start to ask yourself hey what would i do if i were already that person that i want to be if i already bought that 100 business or i already bought my first deal how would i act then what would i have to believe and what actions would i have to do or, or take if i already were where i want to be and when you basically taking action from that different perspective from a mindset of someone who's already where you want to be, your questions are going to be much different within yourself and they're going to be much more positive versus someone who's just always doubting himself, always thinking, what if I can't get there? What if I, I won't be successful? What if this won't work again? What if they're, they're, what they're saying isn't the best strategy? What if I need to go and learn something else? Change your mindset, think with yourself, hey, what if I were the person I want to be right now? What actions would I take? What thoughts would I have? I literally have notifications in my phone every day I have like alarm clocks that is on a repeatable, um, basically an alarm clock every day, asking me different questions to put me in the right state and the right mindset. Otherwise, you can literally go to so many different paths. And, and, and I said it in one of the other videos, you, you start in something, you, you, you grow this grass a little bit, and then you're like, you self-doubt in yourself, you go and do something else, you grow it a little bit, you self-doubt yourself, you go and grow something else. Instead of focusing on one path, one action, and just going up, as much as you can in that one path and it all comes from self-doubt so start asking yourself questions from the better version of yourself if that makes sense you really need to become your own internal coach if that makes sense because asking yourself the right questions and having the the right focus is like a muscle it's like growing a muscle in a gym you gotta consistently work on that and consistently remind yourself of the thoughts that you want to have because it's affecting your subconscious basically the more you repeat stuff the more it's affecting your subconscious and i definitely believe in that and now i know for certain that most of your actions are coming from your subconscious your subconscious is being built from age one to five they say or eight so most of your thoughts and fears coming from that age because you had something going on back then that you were afraid to do and now your life is literally on a repeat because of things that happened to you in the past so if you want to change your subconscious there's many things you can do and i'm actually working with with coaches on a weekly basis to work on my subconscious and change my beliefs but other ways one of the best ways to do it is to repeat certain beliefs that you want to have on a day-to-day -day basis and like i said asking yourself the right questions on a day-to-day -day basis is one of the best things you can do to basically brainwash your your mind and subconscious to change it to where you want to go to now you need to understand what when, when i'm saying focus on the positive there's a sentence that um that says there is no good or bad but thinking make it so and i definitely I, I highly believe in that whatever you're doing there's two ways to look at things right and being positive i'm, I'm not saying that it's like yeah you're gonna you're gonna be happy and all that. I, I don't give a shit about that i'm caring i care right now about you getting results yes obviously you feeling better and all that it's cool and it, it's important but for me staying on the positive is the most important because it's just going to move you to take the right action now many times and again i'm going back to the self-doubt and and when you if you listen to this video like what the fuck it got to do with buying businesses guys this has got everything to do with buying businesses or business or becoming successful in life in general 
in my opinion, there's nothing more important than the mindset. So I really want to emphasize those things. So when I teach you strategies and specific skills, which I already did a lot in this channel, so you can go back and watch the other videos. Like literally, you can you have enough content in this channel to already be successful and buy businesses. And I really want to work on your mindset so you can actually go and take those actions and actually be successful. Now, many times you can't take those actions because you're not surrounded yourself with the right people. And many times the people around you have their doubts and their thoughts just because of their beliefs and the way that they used to live their life. And because you surround yourself a lot with those people, you start to borrow their beliefs, you start to borrow their thoughts and you start to live your life as they live their life. And if you want to change your beliefs and thoughts and actions, you got to surround yourself with people who are doing what you want to do and what you want to achieve. Otherwise, there's no way that you'll be able to borrow or, or even if you ask yourself difficult, different questions all the time, it will be really, really hard to really brain your watch yourself all the day to be positive and believe in the idea, for example, of buying businesses. If everyone around you tell you that it's not possible and those people many times either have an existing job that they're working on every day and hate, or even if they are business owners, many times those are business owners that literally trapped in that business and run it day to day and they just don't know that there's a different um, way to do things. So surround yourself with the right people who are doing what you want to do and are successful at what you want to achieve is so important because even if you with them for one hour a week or two or less or even you watching this video is so good for your beliefs and and thoughts because you just see in real life that it's possible that the way you want to live is possible and that's why in our partner program for example people understand that after they start working with us information is not enough and that's why we are in a day-to-day -day constant touch with our partners Otherwise, they won't get results because, like I said, information is good to have, but it's not enough. And that's what our partners see, that only by us keeping them accountable and staying in touch with them on a the weekly basis, that's how they're able to go and take the right action. Otherwise, even if they have all the content in the world and they, they know from A to Z how to buy businesses, that's not enough. They need the accountability and they need to talk to us on a regular basis, which they do, in order to have those beliefs. And when someone, I had a call this week with one of our new partners and he told me, hey, I'm not sure about doing this or that. And I literally told him, dude, you need to trust the process. This is what we do for a living. I've done it many times. Carl, my partner, did it more than 200 times. You gotta trust in the process. Go and do this. Focus just on the next step. When you're climbing, climbing um, you're trying to climb the, the Everest, they say, don't look at the top, just focus on your next step and trust the process. Trust that if you'll focus on the next step, you'll eventually get to the top. And that's what you need to do in this space as well. And you just need to have someone behind you to tell you your next step is the right step. You're taking it towards the right to the top. You just need to focus on that. Do it the best that you can and trust the process, trust us. And that's what we do with our ac accountability and with our conversations with them. So self-doubt, guys, it's so important. Uh, I really want you to focus on that. In the next video, I'm going to do it. In this this uh, roadblock, this mental roadblocks problems, it's kind of like a series. In the next video, I'm, I'm going to talk about perfectionism. And it's probably one of the biggest things that I see as well. People literally get ready to get ready. And we're going to expand on that in the next video. And what I mean by that, just to give you a, kind of like a tease, it's people basically taking the wrong action and they're always finding ways to uh, make their process perfect. And by that, I mean they go and take different actions. They go and read another book. They're going and, and buying another seminar or a course. And they're trying to perfect the process before they're taking action. They're basically doing everything they can to not take action, to not receive the, the no, to not fail. And so what I'm saying, they're doing everything they can instead of actually going out there and taking the right actions that will actually give them results, which I'm going to expand on in the next video. And what are the actions you need to focus on? Basically actions that there's a chance that you'll get failures and refusals and, and, and hear a lot of no's. So I'm going to expand on that in the next video. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you soon. Hey guys, Moan Pobera here and thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, comment below, help me grow the channel because the more you help me grow the channel, the more deals I'll be able to do and the more I'll be able to give you more value. So please, if you didn't yet, like the video right now, subscribe right now and comment below on this video. Let me know your thoughts. 
and also check in the description below this video there's a text description where you can have a link to a free business buying mastermind group that we have on facebook join it right now if you're not in it yet there are amazing people in there people who are looking or doing deals on a regular basis and you can be part of this conversation so go to the description right now also i'm looking to create daily videos on the topics of buying and growing businesses and i need your help on having ideas for more topics so in the description below you also see a link for a survey where you give me your biggest question you just fill in, fill in your personal details and i'll create a personalized video for you based on your specific question so help me with that put your details below in the survey and give me ideas for videos do it right now after you join the face the facebook group and if you like this type of content or just in general looking to accelerate your growth and buy businesses faster and you want to take things to the next level if you want to see if you're a fit to our partner program and basically have access to a team that did more than 300 deals it's mainly me and my partner Carl Ellen and we have a main CFO who was involved in many many deals so if you want access to that and you want us to be your partners if you want access to us 24 7 i mean access to me in my skype my personal email my phone number if needed and you want us to show you a to z how to buy and grow businesses and how to grow by acquisitions and not just show you what to do but also be there with you and help you close deals as your partners we want to do more deals and we can help you do that You'll learn everything from how to position yourself as a legit buyer if you, if you have no experience and how to use our track record as your dream team and position yourself as a legit buyer in front of business owners and brokers. How to then find motivated sellers because everyone can find business owners and tell them that you want to buy their business but most of them are not motivated to sell their business and we will show you how to find motivated sellers. We'll show you how to talk to those business owners, how to negotiate deals with them, how to get the financials from them and how to use our team to do all the calculations and make sure that the deal is a good deal. Because yes, you can buy a business, but what if it's a shitty business and you don't know how to calculate the right ratios? You don't want to be screwed in this space. You'll then see how to get financing on your, those deals. And not only that, we will open our our contacts and the access to all the financial institutions that we know we will show you how to get accountants and lawyers on success fees and obviously we have our team to do that so you won't need to even find them and we'll then of course show you how to grow those businesses and how to make sure we have someone operating the day-to-day -day for us because unless you want to run businesses day-to-day -day because you're passionate about it we highly suggest you not to do that we can find someone to run the day-to-day -day for us while we in charge of the vision and setting goals for that manager not only that we're going to open our doors to all the financial institutions that you need we are also going to put our personal capital into deals in our group of partners in our shark tank we're going to create some kind of a shark tank where we're going to look at deals that you want to buy and we potentially going to invest our own capital basically going to put some equity kick into those deals so many times you know you can buy a million dollar business but you're missing 50 grand here 100,000 here and we are able to put our personal capital just because we believe in those deals those are our the best deals out there investing in small businesses is, is the best thing an investor can do and we will put the capital into some of those deals as well so if you need help with that you can apply to the program if you never bought a business before or if you have an existing business and you want to grow it by acquisitions and go and buy other complementary businesses. This is for people who understand that they need to invest in themselves in order to get to a point where they can buy a million dollar business. And it's also for, for people who understand that every day that go by and you're not buying another million dollar business and you're not owning another million dollar business, it's costing you million dollar. So if you're trying to learn about this space for one month or two months or one year or two years, every month that go by and you didn't buy a business cost you another one million dollar so don't hustle anymore to get another client for your business let's hustle together to buy a million dollar business as partners and don't get me wrong you can definitely try and do it on your own just by watching my free videos some of the info i have here i literally paid multiple six figures to learn but the partner program is for people who want to accelerate their growth who want to have access to people and contacts and doors that they wouldn't have otherwise this is for people who want to cut their learning curve in years that is for people who are committed to take decisions right now and get results right now so if you don't want to wait go to moranpober.com forward slash talk and me or one of my team members will talk to you to see if it's a fit
The worst case is that you'll get a better clarity on your next steps in this space of buying businesses and will give you all the advice that you want. The best case is that you'll have access to a team that did more than 300 deals who will buy with you as your partners, your first or first, second or as many businesses as you want with you as soon as possible. So if you want, go right now to moranpober.com forward slash talk and I'll talk to you soon. I hope you enjoyed this video and the other videos on this channel. Like, subscribe, comment, help me grow the channel, help me buy more businesses so I can help you buy yours as well. Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you soon.